Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ugh. That was off tune. Try it again. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Well, you did okay. That wasn't the worst thing in the world. I have something new for you guys. I have not reviewed ice cream. Uh, my lighting is really bad. Yikes. Um, I have the Trevor picked up at Meyer the. Hudsonville Dairy Free Frozen Dessert Caramel Cookie Dough. I am excited that, so excited that I just had to try it right after my meeting. So let's dig in. Okay, so I'm gonna do what I always do. I check the ingredients and the label to see if there's anything interesting. So the dairy-free milk of choice here is coconut cream. Um, they use also oat powder. Anything else I see interesting in here? Dark brown sugar, okay. Yeah, contains coconut and wheat. Calories. Uh, uh, 230 for two-thirds cup only 690 for the whole container I feel like that's kind of good it's like almost 700 calories but like whatever you know yeah exactly oh it's that's bad okay sugars 20 grams carbs 31 guys let's dig in I'm so excited cookie dough is my favorite ice cream and um yeah, my favorite ice cream flavor. And so I am excited to try this out. Maybe I'll let Trevor do the first. I'll let him try. It's kind of, oh, this lighting is atrocious. It's kind of like, um, what's that called? Marshmallow stuff fluff? That's, isn't it kind of like that? Soft. Yeah. I'm gonna, I don't really smell anything. Okay, anyways, Trevor's gonna try it first. All right, baby kickies. Mm -hmm. He's eating steak right now. And I'm pretty yes, sure that doesn't really go well, steak and oh, ice cream. Pair's the best. With a little vino. Steak, ice cream, and wine. You're gonna be on the toilet. That was sexy. Tastes like a candle. No! Stop! I'm not even joking. Let the expert try. I didn't see any. Oh, here we go. Here's a cookie dough piece. There's not a lot of cookie dough in here. How much did this cost, baby? Four ninety nine. Four ninety nine. That's a lot of money. I need to get a lot of ice cream. I mean, a lot of cookie dough bits. Okay, moment of truth. Which I did not get. In my bit. Hmm. I didn't get no cookie dough. Tastes like a fall candle. Okay. I get the little bits of wax that he's talking about, the like candly taste. I don't know what that is. I'm not getting bits of wax. I'm just it's like a waxing. However, I would eat it. I think it's good. It is so, the texture is so nice. It's like the texture of soft serve ice cream. I feel like so far it's one of the best textures that I've ever had with non-dairy ice cream. Should I do non-dairy ice cream reviews now? The cookie dough bits are a little 
the texture's a little off. So on the side here, it just says, oh, uh, it's made with oat milk and with coconut cream. Well, I think I said that, didn't I? Bourbon reviews in a bikini. You get a lot of followers that way. No one wants to see me in a bikini. Oh! What? Oh! I do. This is good, guys. I would 100% eat this. Look at you in a bikini top. Okay, why are we talking about <laughs> me being in a bikini? Golly. Um, baby, how many flavors did you see of this? Make you money. How many flavors? Probably, I saw six at least on the shelf, but it looked like there was some missing too. Okay. It's been flying off the shelves. I like this. Trevor doesn't like it. I would say for sure, it's creamy. It has a really good texture. The taste is not like exactly like a non-dairy, I mean a dairy ice cream, but I think it's pretty close. It's probably the best that I've had so far. It's less um, sugary. Mm -hmm. It doesn't taste like pure sugar. That's really nice. Um, I give this a eight. I would eat the mess out of this. What about you, baby? Try it again. We're gonna make him try it again with some cookie dough pieces. Yeah, I didn't get any cookie dough. Yeah, I got it now. Does it have anything to do with the steak and the wine? I just get a weird... <coughs> okay. The drama. It's, it's pretty good. But I don't know why. It just makes me feel like I'm eating a candle. A but you can't explain why just like, I feel like, like that's a, not really a good candle taste or smell or something like how many candles have you tasted I eat in a your lot life of <laughs> okay I do get what you're saying though I I get the waxy part I guess but you said not the wax I feel like this the base of this would be what wax would taste like it's but not, it's good if that makes not any sense the consistency of the ice cream for me it's no, like, it's the flavor has like a chemically candle -y type taste to me. Like it's a synthetic caramel. So it's the caramel that you don't like? Maybe. Because it is a caramel. Maybe that's what's throwing me off. Cookie dough. Caramel is nothing but sugar. That's why I stick to meat. Trevor. Meat. Cheese and peppers. He's gonna die by the age of like 50. From if I'm lucky. a heart attack or something. High cholesterol. Anyways, okay. Yes, so I recommend this ice cream for sure. Sorry for all of the blabbing that we have been doing, but get to see our dynamic. I'm gonna finish eating a couple more spoons of this and I'm going to bed. Thank you for watching. See you next time. I think I'm going to start reviewing non-dairy um, ice, ice creams. Cream. I'm so excited. Ice cream, ice cream. Ice cream. Okay, no, let's go. Ready? <clears throat> We're going to redeem ourselves. Go ahead and chew your steak bits. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream for ice cream. Bye, guys.